Hello traders, this is Elizabeth Bilgina and you are watching the daily stock market review by Tradimo. Summer started with a negative mood of financial markets. The traders keep being worried about trade tensions between the United States and China. China implemented retaliatory tariffs on US goods and also we get the situation of escalation of trade tensions between the United States and Mexico. In the situation like this, traders are afraid of global economic slowdown, about a slowdown in America as well. Uh, different analysts estimate the probability and uh, the timing of potential recession, so the mood is pretty sour. In addition, we got some confirmation that indeed um, the situation is not um, good by the fact that US ISM manufacturing PMI released on Monday came out at the lowest level in almost a decade. So. We can see that the fears are reasonable and S&P 500 index opened with a gap down, then uh, tried to recover, helped by some uh, rebound in oil prices. However, still uh, the stock market is below the 200 day moving average at 2773.50, the former support, which is now acting as resistance. and. Um, higher we get the next resistance level at 2800 which also should uh, be a significant obstacle for bulls on the downside support is lying at 38.2 fibonacci level at 27.22 and uh, the next fibonacci level is located in the 26.46.50 area on Tuesday, we'll hear uh, more speeches of FOMC members and in particular, uh, there will be a speech of the Fed's Chair Powell uh, and it will be interesting how he comments on the situation and whether we get more signals of um, upcoming rate cuts in the United States if the Fed is determined to reduce interest rates that might provide some help to the stock market and allow it to test various resistance uh, levels we have mentioned. Let's move to particular stocks and here we have to mention the stock of FedEx. As you can see, it tested the lowest level since uh, December in the area of 150.80. And uh, the stock is under pressure as China probes wrongful deliveries cases after Trump's ban on Huawei. And uh, that is limiting the upside for FedEx stock and such companies as Alphabet, Qualcomm and Intel are also vulnerable to this probing from Chinese uh, side. As for Alphabet, it opened with a gap to the downside and then declined to the uh, Fibonacci level around 1040. Uh, the stock is under pressure um, as it fell most since April after Bloomberg reported that the Department of Justice will look into the company's business. It's, uh, it looks like a serious allegation and um, if we get below the Fibonacci level around 1038 uh, mark, then uh, the decline towards $1,000 and uh, lower levels around 970 will be also uh, quite possible. This is all for today. Thank you for your attention and follow the stock market with Tradimo. Subscribe to YouTube channel.